Hi everyone, it's Shane from Hanlon's for another Maintenance Monday. Today we're going to start our series on the 700 Gen 6. The exterior of the tractor is very similar to the old tractors, but the interior is laid out slightly different. And so we're going to go through that section by section over the coming weeks. Today we'll just do a general overview and give you an idea of what the, what the cab looks like inside, especially the screens, and we'll go from there. So to start out with, we'll just look, have a look at the, the new dash here. So you can see the layout of the new dash. Um, you still have over on the side here your parking brake, um, but you can see where um, neutral is displayed now. You still have the two flashing icons for your direction indicator. Your 1-2 is now in the center of the screen where you can see which range you're in. Um, RPM, miles an hour, kilometers an hour are the same. This one down in the bottom corner is your hydraulic level. You can see your PTO speed displayed down at the very bottom there. And then of course, your water temperature, your air brake pressure, your def level and your fuel level uh, displayed on the dash there. So as we move over to the, the bigger terminal, the 10.4 inch Vario terminal was replaced with the 12 inch terminal. Um, it's still a touch screen terminal. So whatever you want to do, you touch and, and you can change accordingly. Uh, the return button always takes you back to where you were or there's a home button as well. Um, there's a bit of a change as far as, as what you can do um, for adjusting. You used to have that little console on the side of the terminal. Now it's changed to a rotary dial and a push button um, and some other button packs there that you can use. It's actually quite a bit easier to use. Um, the little joystick is slightly different. Your grapple control is right on there as well. Um, the main joystick, slightly different, but you still have the same functionality as far as buttons go. Um, colors remain the same, so orange for for uh, cruise control and tractor controls. Blue is for hitch, yellow is for your PTO, and then now you have the addition of the white buttons that do some other functions. Hopefully that gives you a quick overview of what it looks like, and then we will continue to go through the items section by section in the following weeks. Hopefully that gives you a little insight into the basics and that it helps you out. Thanks for watching.